The thing. whole insecure thing, I do want to go around the table because there are quite a few girls here who have OnlyFans. Maybe those of you who don't, you have your own thoughts on this too. Do you think it's insecure if a guy would not want to date a woman who's involved with fans or, or sex work? Do you think that's it's an insecurity that the man has? Starting with you, go around. Um, I wouldn't say he's insecure. Um, I just think everybody's different. You know, each person has their own <clears throat> preference. I mean... Okay. I do think it takes a very secure man, though, to be with a girl who has an only. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> She's like pretending I don't she ain't know. there. I think if you if if there is a guy and he likes you, even if you get an OnlyFans or do something like porn or something, but he likes you, he will be with you. He will. Well, be how you. how early into the relationship are you re revealing you have an OnlyFans? Huh? Say it again, please. <laughs> like so. Do you tell them right like away if, that you have are you, like, cause, Yeah, of course. Why not? But for a lot of guys, well, I kind of want to let everybody answer. So, but you think you think that if he really likes you, he'll accept it? Is it what you're yeah, saying? Yeah, because uh, there is a reason why you do then then uh, this OnlyFans. You know, as a girl, you have a reason why you do it. So if you tell him the reason why you do it, and he agree with you, what's why not? what's the reason? My own reason? You want to hear is my... It, is it for money? Uh, the reason I was that I was it. in my country. Okay. No, I was with no money. Mm -hmm. okay. I was no one. Mm -hmm. And I wanted left my country. So I started doing OnlyFans. Then one agency with bo a box agency in my country uh, invited me to the box. And I showed my boobs after a fight. Uh, it goes viral, you know. Work. I started to earn a lot of money. <laughs> <laughs> I start to uh, earn a lot of money, so I uh, I decide titty to titty boxing. What's it called? <laughs> titty boxing? No, no, it's oh, okay. it's a real like a real uh, boxing uh, agency, you know. But Booby I did okay. So so you boxed and you wanted to come here and yeah. So, so I I just you've been I just here for three years, so you're here. So now it's for money. No, listen. <laughs> It's still for boxing. You want to go to Sweden to next? I where are you trying to go? Little, you trying to go to Norway? Where are, we, where are you going? <laughs> Oh, huh? sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, go ahead. Can you listen go ahead. A little? Go ahead. I was go in ahead. a little village in uh, Eastern Slovakia. Yeah, it sucked. You want to come here? I get it. I started to earn money, and now yep. I can live here with money, and I just enjoy my life, and okay. I do whatever but you're I here. want to do. You're here now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I'm here now. So, I guess we understand why you originally got into it. Yeah. But it's not clear to me if the reasons with which, like, for example, let's say you were in a. Um, Let's say you got arrested for uh, drug dealing mm. and you told the judge, you told the jury, whatever. Well, I had a really rough upbringing and I was very poor and I wanted to leave the inner but city. I wanted to go to California. It's different to be a drug dealer and be an only friend. But it, the, the reasons don't really like there, there's still the negative consequences of what you're doing. I so the, the I reasons are kind of irrelevant. I don't take it like it's negative, you know? For Wait. me, it was it saved my life. For, but, but, I, I'm so grateful. Okay, so I'm grateful for let, that let job. Let me put it. Let me put it to you like this. That's it. cool. 